Hello YouTubers, this is R26 H. Miles Riley. Today is Sunday the 15th of December 2013 and I'm going to be showing you my skateboard setup. Now, after Christmas, I'm hoping you to get a Heroin Mark Foss Foster Scatterbrain deck or I'm hoping to get a Toy Machine deck. Uh, I want it to have independent solar star trucks, buds red bearings, shorties or fracture hardware. Um, not sure about the grip tape yet. Wheels either Spitfire or Def Urophane because they say skate ain't terrain with Def Urophane. So yeah, let's take a look at my skateboard right now. So here is the skateboard. Okay, so up here. Graffiti, I'll explain what. Hookups. Hookups is one of my top 5, top 10, top 50, top 100 skateboard companies. Reason being, here's a uh, tech deck. As you know, tech decks are made by real skateboard companies. Um, this is a Hookups tech deck, and it's called Hookups Dream Girl. And Hookups, as you can see, there's Japanese writing above it. Hookups does anime designs on their boards. And I'm an otaku, and an otaku is a name for someone who's really into anime and manga. So I've got a manga book here. See, and like, manga is different from other comics because you, you have to read this right to left instead of left to right. See? This book reads from right to left. And then if you go to the back of the book... It says, this is the last page. So, yeah. And then, uh, down here I got, uh, Neo magazine. And, uh, My M, the, 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 the December 2013 issues. And that's why you should keep them. I keep my Neos there. And I keep my My M's there. Uh, okay, so, Waves. It's one of my favorite music bands. They do like skateboarder or surfer music. Uh, my favorite YouTubers, uh, skateboard YouTubers on YouTube are Joel Siciliano, aka Schedule Five Six Seven, and Andrew Schrock. And one of Joel's mates made a video of him skateboarding in Kiwahoga, and they had a wave song on there, and it was called Mickey Mouse, and I just really loved it. Um, Spitfire, I've got Spitfire Cheap Shot Barons on here. Um. The Spitfire sticker is on the back of my phone. I'm gonna have to show you in the mirror. So let me just okay. Uh, cover the flashlight. See it? Yep. Um. And then, uh, as you can see, I'm a massive fan of Pink Floyd because I'm wearing a Dark Side of the Moon T-shirt. It's an early Christmas present from my mate. Thank you very much for that. Thank you very much for that, buddy. Uh, yeah. Uh, the Margin Hammers logo. And then, uh, if you look there, I have a Margin Hammers mug. Uh, my friend, he did the Black Veil Brides logo. And he did right in there. I uh, got the Zoo York logo. Uh... Last relationship I was in. Um, yeah. <clears throat> Keep going, go skateboarding. Keep calm, listen to Rabbit Junk, which is another brand that I really like. Keep calm, listen to Pink Floyd. It's got a little tiny dark side of the moon. Lo uh, there. And then keep calm with manga. Yeah. And then, keep calm, watch anime. Alright. Anime. Woo! Yeah! Uh, okay. I got Element logo, Airwalk logo. Apparently, Airwalk's not even a skateboard company anymore. 
Um, because it was a Skipple company when it first started, but then, like, it got bought out by a company called Payless. And, um, yeah, so now, I see loads of people walking around Gloucester all the time. And they're wearing airwalks, and they're not even skateboarders. Like, they're just normal people. In my opinion, they don't see it as a skateboard brand, they just see it as a brand. And they just like some normal footwear brand, so they just wear it. Um, for me, personally... I only think you should wear skateboard stuff. Right. I only think you should wear skateboard stuff if you like skateboarding and support it, or if you actually do it. Don't like go around wearing like an Etnies T-shirt if you don't even know that's a skateboard company. If you know what I mean, yeah. Uh, as you can see, I'm wearing a elk beanie. I was wearing an elk belt. Oh yeah, and this came off my airwalk backpack. It was the Dark Side of the Moon, uh, Dark Side of the Moon key ring. It came off my bag yesterday, and I put it through one of the, I put it through one of the belt loops. Haha. <laughs> and yeah, hanging it on there now. <laughs> so I have to take it off when I put the G's in the washer course. Get rusted otherwise. Um. I got an airwalk poster. On, on there, but phone's charging at the moment, so I can't really show you. Uh, and then, uh, DC logo. So it's probably just some grip tape or something. Rolling since. Just Yeah, 2002, because that's when I started. I started 25th December 2002. Skateboarding, yeah. And then... Oh, uh, <coughs> yuck! Uh, yuck. The smell of the Sharpie. Um, old English text, Al. And I didn't do that... In st I did not do that from stencil. I actually drew that. Yeah. Um, Al is a very popular character from... Uh, a very popular anime series called Death Note. Yeah, and he uses that for it. And then this is a company that I want to make. And that's a company my mate wants to make, and I came up with the logo for it. And then here, there's the anime that I told you about. Death Note. And then... Here at the bottom, Pink Floyd Wall again. With a couple of bricks missing. Right. Okay, so I've just spent about seven minutes just talking about the grip tape. So now we move on to the actual other stuff. So it's got... Um, <coughs> one inch shorties. Uh, I think it's uh, shorties Allen hardware. It's starting to get a bit rusted. I think the deck is a uh, eight inch. It was given to me by a friend who nearly got a sponsorship. It's a 50-50 bridge deck. It's got, okay, stickers. Zoo York. Shorties. Spitfire. ADO. Fabric skateboards. Vans. Uh... This is a sticker for a band. Up oh, the monkey bird. Uh, pro Irish skateboarder Dennis Lynn. He has this thing called the monkey bird. I don't actually know what it is. Uh, this is my mate's signature. Uh, this is a the other thing at Gloucester called uh, the massacre. I didn't go to it, but a friend gave me the sticker for it. Uh, and then side of skateboard magazine sticker, and then bones red sticker. I haven't got Bones Reds on it, but it's time to put Bones Reds on it. And then it's got independent bushings. World Industries trucks, and they are freaking shit. Um, plain lazy wheels. Yeah, and like I said, cheap shop bearings. Spitfire cheap shop bearings. Yeah. The deck's alright. The wheels are very good for manuals, because I love doing manuals.
But I skateboarded this in the rain yesterday, so I don't know. Yeah. I'll, I'll get it to work, don't worry. Yeah. So this is it for the review on my skateboard setup at the moment. Hopefully, it will go better after Christmas. I can do a much better review. So, comments down below, and uh, yeah. Feel free to subscribe if you want. Peace out.